So we're going to try old uh, Trails in 10 year straight bourbon whiskey finished in Oregon oak casks. So they pick some select barrels from Kentucky. They follow the spiritual path of the Oregon Trail and finish in their own Oregon Gary Oak casks. Yeah, let's pop this shit and see how it goes. <laughs> he only got halfway through it and gave up. He's like, enough of this shit. There are a lot of little words. <laughs> Start getting old, you can't see that well. I don't have to bust out my reading glasses. All right, let's pop this cork. Here we go. Oh, yummy. Look at that smoking. Mm, trails end. Uh, when was the last time you saw Trails beginning? <laughs> yeah, are you trying to say I'm fat? <laughs> I'm trying to say I ain't seen you on no hiking trail ever. You probably won't. <laughs> unless I'm on a four wheeler. Unless there's bourbon at the end of it. <laughs> that's right. The Kentucky Bourbon Trail. Hey. How about that one? Hey, that's a good one. Hey, that's good enough for me. That's a good, that's the best trail you can go on. That's right. So we've had the eight year. We have. It was straight oh, bourbon. It was great. Was it straight bourbon? I think it was. Oh, uh, I don't know. Shit, I got a cut on my thumb. That did not feel good. We don't have it anymore, so there's no point uh, checking. We done drank it all. I could have bought another one. Anyway. Oh, that's yeah, yeah. Nice yeah, color, too. Mm. Yeah, it's a dark amber color. Wow. Hold on. I'm wondering where they're sourcing this out of. Kentucky. Well, <laughs> it says well, right on the label. Um, I know that. I'm talking about which distillery. Uh, probably produced. It just says produced and bottled by Hood River in Oregon. You act like I haven't read the label ten times. You probably did. That's why I had to read it again to verify if he was correct or not. Well, it's got a little funk on it, so I'm kind of leaning towards possibly 1792. That could be. It does have that 1792 funk. Very sweet, though, man. Nice legs. Not you, the bourbon. Well, that's the last <laughs> time I wear Daisy Dukes around you. <laughs> How rude. Mmm, <laughs> that does smell mildly good. Vanilla. Oh, yeah. Mm. Always have vanilla and caramel. Well, most of the time. Some great oak in there. That OCD number five didn't have much vanilla. That was all barrel. That's good shit, too. Man, I'm ready to get into this one. Cheers. All right, cheers. Mmm. That is delicious. Definitely get hit with a lot of that oak and caramel. On the back end, the oaks there, yep. And the spice. Real nice mouthfeel, though, man. Thick. Mm hmm. What's that fancy word they say? Viscous. Viscous. <laughs> I guarantee I spell it wrong. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Quite nice. Uh, not sure where they get it from as far as the distillery goes. I'm going to lean maybe towards either 1792 or Bardstown. Yeah. Seems to have that profile. But a very, very pungent nose, like as far as, you know, that punch of sweetness. Big vanilla. Little, going back in, I'm getting a little tobacco. There it is, tobacco. But that, uh, that mouthfeel, though, man, and the finish. Tobacco, leather, caramel. Yeah, it's all there. And that's nice. Spicy. And it's like, not, like a baking spice, not like spicy as in. What's the proof on this? 105? 105. Yeah. No, uh. Had to read the label again, didn't you? Well. <laughs> I read the Called label. out. Uh, it real, real, real good on the finish, man. It's, an, it's a nice hug, but it's not an overpowering hug. Very, very crushable for a 10 year. Sourced and then refinished uh, for, for an Oregon release. Probably one of my favorites. Yeah, and that oak comes out in that new finished release or finished. Uh... <laughs> blah, 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 blah. Oh man! I don't drink bourbon. <laughs> He's a professional, ladies and gentlemen. Professional eater. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
what'd mm. you get? Do you know you <laughs> smashed yours? <laughs> yours I did. Well. You know, that's because I need a little bit of mouth. I got a big mouth, you know? Mm -hmm. Just a little bit. A little bit helps the sugar go down. Uh, all right, you done chairs to do any chairs. Yep, that's good shit.